If elected, what would you do to help continue to promote job growth and grow Florida's economy? I've been speaking to a lot of voters, and the biggest issue with regard to job growth in our economy has been our education system. It's a direct correlation. Now, I, I, I've seen uh, the numbers, and I see that there are a lot of kids that are coming out of our public school system, and they don't, they don't necessarily go to college right away, and they may want a productive skill set. So I would like to see an expansion of our apprenticeship programs and our vocational programs. If you improve our education system, you'll have companies coming down to Florida. We won't have to promote as hard or incentivize as much. So I think it all comes down to education. How would you improve Florida's health care situation? Currently, there's over a million people in the state of Florida that are making too much money to get access to, um, uh, to Medicaid and not enough money for private pay insurance. So uh, there's been the talk of Medicaid expansion for the working wounded, those people who are working, who are trying to be productive members of society, who are productive members of society, but they can't get access to quality health care. So my, I, I would be in favor of Medicaid expansion. What challenges do you see in Florida's K-12 through education system? And if elected, what would you do to address those challenges? The number one challenge that I've heard from most of the voters when I go knocking door to door has been resources. Do the teachers have enough resources? Do they have the proper resources? And it doesn't matter what school you're at, if you're in A school, B school, or C school. I want to make sure that there's more accountability of where the money's going in our public school system, but also making sure that the teachers have the proper resources to provide a world-class education for the students that are coming through our, our school system. I'm David Silvers. I'm running for House District 87 in Palm Beach County. You can learn more about me and my race at votedavidsilvers.com.